So, Jenny Wiley, we are in our second production of the summer season. They just opened up Mary Poppins last weekend to an absolutely fantastic opening. Fortunately, we still have two more chances for people to come out and see this. It is the classic tale of Mary Poppins, the Broadway version made in a junior size. And then immediately following that, it's running um, until July 7th. And then starting on July 12th, we have Blood Song opening up at the Jenny Wiley Amphitheater. It's the official story of the Hatfield and McCoys and actually has several descendants from both sides of the feud in that show and it runs Friday and Sundays all the way through July 26th. So what's interesting with this one, so we've had a little bit of changes happening at the amphitheater and it is such a fantastic venue that we, uh, no way were we not going to have something on that stage. And so we've partnered up with actually two different organizations, one being Artist Collaborative Theater out of Elkhorn City. And then we've partnered up with the Hatfield McCoy Arts Council has, who's been doing um, some of the most tremendous work over the last five years to bring Blood Song into here. So every show starts at 8.15 including Sundays. Initially we were looking at some matinees and we thought nope we're gonna wait till the Sun comes down because half the magic is being underneath those stars so every show is 815. We wanted a great variety of music, music of our area which was the bluegrass music of Cotton Patch Gospel, Mary Poppins Jr. Man it's hard not to smile during that show and feel good which is what summer theater should be about and then Blood Song which just brings so much rich history um, and really just brings a story to life in the best way possible.